What's up guys, it's Dallas from Softmodder, and today we're going to check out a new way of creating your very own 3D live wallpapers. At the center of the Softmod are two different apps, Google's new camera app and OppoTech's new depth photo live wallpaper. But I've got a full tutorial with download links and whatnot waiting for you at the link in the description below, so it shouldn't be hard to get this going. To start, we'll take a picture using the Google Camera app's lens blur feature. With this one, you hit the shutter button, and then you kind of just slowly slide the phone upward. Okay, so while that picture processes, I'll tell you what it's doing. The first stage, where I hit the shutter button, created a reference frame. The sliding gesture allowed it to sort of map the items in that reference frame to create a 3D map. Normally, the Google Camera app uses this 3D map to create a blur effect for items in the background or the foreground of your picture. But this app, Depth Photo Live Wallpaper, handles that 3D map differently. So I'll open it up and check out the settings. First up, this is the free version of the app, so not all features are available. To unlock all those features, there's an in-app purchase of like a dollar something. So not too bad, right? You basically just hit this Choose Lens Blur Photo button. And since I'm pretty sure it's finally done processing, I'll just choose my most recent photo here. Then you can see the app loading the image and interpreting the 3D map. If you back out, you can see your wallpaper already. I'll just hit Set Wallpaper and we can check out the effect it's applied. It's a parallax effect that's driven by your phone's sensors, which in the end essentially means that you can see your photo from a slightly different perspective when you change the angle that you're holding your phone. The free version of this app only utilizes the accelerometer inside your phone, so this effect can be a little shaky. Maybe I just have shaky hands, though. But the paid version allows you to fine-tune this effect to your liking and even use a gyroscope, so there's always that option. But yeah, for the full breakdown on this, not to mention all sorts of cool tips and tricks, be sure to check out my article in the description. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, guys, but until then, happy soft modding!